guys, it's your boy Sanderj97 here, bringing you back to another Red Dead Redemption 2 video. In our last video, we finally got Jack back. What? What? Oh yeah. It's nice place you brought us to, my brother. Yes, lovely, isn't it? Ah, uh, makes me miss freezing to death in the mountains. <laughs> Yeah. It's probably because of mosquitoes. I don't blame him. We go see Hosea, go see Mary Beth. What up, Sadie? This is Adler. Hey. You look pissed off. No more than usual. Okay. Checking you're all right. All right, Arthur. Oh, my just talking to Abigail. I never, uh, never told you this, but you're quite a woman. Thank you. Oh, quite. Don't be fooling with John's girl. You can make a fellow real happy. Hey, Pearson. Bet you know how. I got work to do. <clears throat> You're sneaky one, Morgan. I know your type. Don't mind me. Jesus. Bye now. Hey. Morning. No, Bad why are you saying good morning to him? That idiot. About as charming as a slug. You let me know if it gives you any more hash. Yeah. Good morning. Oh, here's John and Sadie talking. Oh, they probably just got done. Hey, Karen. What? Take it easy with that stuff. This is taking it easy. No, it's not. I know it's because of Sean. I really hate you're going down this path, Karen. Alright. If we can't get that bank job, then we could probably just talk to Hosea. Let me just see oh, what's going on in St. Denis. Gotta go see Mary again. I gotta go see Brother Dorkins. That guy that Swanson talked about. Let's go see Hosea. Hosea. Hey, Adler. Come on! If we're gonna make it to this party, we sure as shit better clean up a little. So we're doing this? Oh, yeah. Old friend Dutch Vandalin is finally showing his true colors. Social climate. Old Senor Bronte, that horrendous snake, has invited us to the ball, Cinderella. So my suggestion is we go and get you down. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Just damn. I get that Jose is here, but why is Bill here? Shouldn't Gentlemen, John be here since he was also at the house? I'm afraid the mayor does not allow guns at official functions after last year's incident. What happened last year? Luca here will take you to Mr. Bronte. I believe he is expecting you. Follow me, gentlemen. Oh, everyone else gets to wear a hat. Well, 
Dodge is the only one wearing a hat, but everyone else, yeah. Like this before. Follow them. Alright. It's been a while since I did this sort of mission. I know we're supposed to be looking for stuff to rob. <laughs> ah, the angry cowboys. Oh, there is a son of a bitch. <laughs> oh, this is quite a party you've invited us to. Yeah, it's quite something, although I'm not quite sure what. <laughs> so, this is Sandini High Society. Yes, apparently so. And all these people, these are friends of yours, Senor Bronte? No, 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 not quite, not quite. But they certainly are afraid of me. Like that one. See that wretch? He's the mayor. <laughs> Henri Lemieux. <laughs> He'll do anything for a dollar, and I mean anything. Politics is a foul business. Yes. Oh, and that one too. That is Alberto Fusar. He owns a sugar plantation out on the island, and he comes here to whore and despoil himself. <laughs> Oh, oh, and that, that is Hobart Crowley, a, a confederate major in the war, I mean, hero, they say, but that, this is his very young wife, I mean, a young mistress, that's the natural order. Yeah, she almost like, looks like Mary Beth. wife, it's unseemly. Oh, oh, the Redskins, <laughs> I have no sympathy for them. Oh, yeah, we'll be meeting them later. Enough to get tricked by the Americans, no? <laughs> they get what they deserve, huh? <laughs> yes, and no, that's not true. Oh, yeah, that will save you. <laughs> oh, I fucking hate racism. And that, that is Hector Fellows, this self-righteous newspaper man. Maybe, maybe you will kill him for me one day. <laughs> We're not paid killers as such, not in cold blood anyway. I did not know you were so particular that uh, you wouldn't help a friend. Oh, I'm willing to help in any way I can, uh, within reason. Yeah, I'm going to pretend to understand what that means. I'm in no <laughs> God damn. None taken. None taken. None taken. <laughs> All these vulgar people, they hate me. <laughs> Non vedo l'ora di guardarti morire. <laughs> well, uh, it has been wonderful conversing with you, but I can tell that you are very busy and I won't waste any more of your time. Yes, yes, yes. Go, enjoy yourselves and mingle with this vulgar scum. It'll make you long for the days when you could shoot each other and scoop cows out on the open range. <laughs> Those sure were the days. Good day, gentlemen. Mm, good day to you. But before you go, what uh, exactly are your plans here? Well, we've not made any... Well... We are going to need some money. Money. Oh... Uh, yes. Yeah, this is but where it comes in. money at the trolley station. They keep a lot of cash there in the day. Now, I could not involve myself in such uh, matters. But you, pff, as a guest, yes! As my guest, bah! Do it, huh? <laughs> okay, good day, gentlemen. Goodbye. <laughs> okay, How do they not find this a little suspicious? <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's go to the party. I'll show you to the party, gentlemen. If you'll kindly follow me. That was shut moments ago. I was gonna say, can I go faster? Gentlemen, enjoy your evening. Yeah, I'm already doing that. Gentlemen, let's go ingratiate ourselves. Are you guys hanging out right here the whole time? 
not really getting into the party. Okay. What? We'll find the mayor if you can and stay out of trouble and steal nothing unless it's information. Of course. Jose, Got it. you go find us some place to rob. Bill, go make us some new friends. I'm gonna find out of old Cornwall and what's Oh, I could go already. Alright. Sure. Take some champagne. Oh yeah, this guy. Good evening, sir. Oh, I gotta save him. Help. I yeah, just dropped the damn glass. Hey! You're welcome. Oh, my lord. The pesky nut. What a way to go, eh? Oh, thank yep. you, sir. Oh, yes. Oh, thank you. Algin and Wolf, sir. Hello. Uh, Tacitus Kilgo. Hello, Mr. Kilgo. No, what is it that, uh, that you do? I'm, uh, I'm an adventurer. Oh, that me too. Yeah, I'm always going around. Pursuer of the exotic. And then again, I still need to um, hunt more legendary animals and more animal skins. Heathens. My card, sir. Except it. Can you visit in my atelier? I must just go and purge. I intend to stay thin until I pass away. Damn. Alright. This is in New York. Do you bake with anyone in the South? Not one I particularly like. How do you do? Down for these. I can't offer them champagne. Alright. Oh! Look at that. D dick. Can I come out of your hat? Okay, really? to get that part. I'm just exploring the area a little. I always loved bastards. The real ones, I mean. Good evening to you, sir. <laughs> Go find some other people to threaten to hate me. If that's okay with you. So, you know, bastards and marriage. I even married a bastard. I mean, did you hear what that man said? In yes. Do you think women should have the vote? I was listening. 
Can I talk to her? I know I look like a drunken harlot, but let me be very clear, young man. I am a drunken harlot. So is Karen. Oh, you want more champagne? Can I offer them? Oh, offer them champagne. Alright. Ladies. Oh, you still have some. All right. I think that's everything I did. Now I should go over there. How was the show? I heard you went. Oh. These dancers. Well, if that's French culture for you, sign me up for French lessons. How do you do? Would you like to get some righteous know-it-all? Excuse me. Yes. Hello? Hello? Alright. Anyone else I should encounter? Oh. Why don't you just back off? Why don't you just fuck off? Gents. What other people should I run into? I know there was more people I should have ran into. By now. I can't talk to that guy again. Let me double check. Does you have room, Southern? Dutch. By the town that you have here, Mr. Jennings. Oh, I don't live here. I was here for poker. Oh, you play? All right. Where's that coming from? Alright. Thank you, sir. My pleasure. Henri Lemieux. 
I hope you're enjoying my party. The mayor. Allegedly. There's quite a place you got here. <laughs> it's not mine, and the city is horribly in debt, but we can still put on a good show. Do you know Evelyn Miller? My lord. Ryder? Well, we seem to have another deranged drunkard on our hands. Shall we? Fireworks. <laughs> You should get that beard looked at, Arthur. Probably get it looked at when we do the boat robbery. Uh, Mr. Mr. Cornwall was quite insistent, I'm afraid. Uh, he shouted down the telephone for several minutes. Mr. Cornwall is a horse's ass and a bad horse. I'm very sorry, sorry. It's not he is a horse's ass. Him. I'll come in and sign it in a minute. Let me enjoy the fireworks. Of course. Let me say something about Cornwall. Yes. Yep. Find out what. Alright. Dolahan's fight. Follow the servant and remain undetected. Alright. Jeez, folks. I'm on a mission. guy hey. is everything taken care of the telephone it keeps ringing the mayor said he was the server will notice you if you get too close okay luckily I'm hiding oh Please tell me you didn't see me. Arthur? Alright. Wait for him to be in another room. Okay, good. Now it's my chance. Before he comes back. If he fucking comes back. Yeah. Okay, letters from Bronte to the mayor. Oh, that seemed important too. Alright, let's go. Alright. Dutch. Hello there. Why are you 
doing this? Why are you in my way? Oh shit, I wasn't paying attention. I was on my damn phone. Sorry guys, I'm coming. Arthur, can you be any faster, dude? I thought we were still in a damn cutscene. Sorry to keep you waiting, fellas. Themselves. Oh, high society pigeon shit. If you ask me, it's more like torture. Well, that's sort of the point, isn't it? Let the people torture themselves. Here's them papers I took. Uh, let me see you take this. I don't think so. Hmm. Hopefully. I might have an idea. Let me think on it. times I guess so what's next dancing lessons Portland more along the lines of armed robbery Jose is handling reconnaissance on the bank he and Abigail are gonna run some distractions see how the law react good oh and I spoke to Evelyn Miller fine man here helping the Indian chief we saw yeah I met him too Mayor. He's lobbying officials in San Denis on their behalf. Maybe we could help. Maybe. Now, I think there's a lot of money on the riverboat. A lot of money. And Trelawney, he's investigating for us. He says to meet him at the tailors. Okay. One big score down yes. here, Arthur, and we disappear. We are almost heading home. And where is home? I don't know. Exactly. But I can smell it. I'm gonna go investigate this trolley thing old Bronte was talking about. Okay. Now I'm about to say, if I'm gonna go see Mary, I don't wanna see me like this. No gold? Damn, how did Dutch move so fast? Alright. Well, I'll party, pour some drinks, compliment on a guest, accept a gift, and say they accept a gift. Where do I do that? I was looking all over the place. Oh, tough shit. I missed it. Abigail. Arthur. What did you forget? That's how you get the good point. We're talking about. Oh, no. Hey there. We don't need you getting in no more. Where's John and Jack? Oh, there they are. I'm just fine. Why? No reason. You got some guts, kid. That's for sure. <laughs> He's likely going to forget about all this when he grows up. All right. Good morning, Arthur. Jackie boy. Good morning, dude. All right. Hey there. So, you going to look into this bank? Yes. I want to make sure we're fully prepped before making any moves. Sure. Alright. Yeah, let's go see Trelawney. Hi there. Hey, Karen. Always good to see you. Oh, you're back? Yeah, I've been back. Keeping out of mischief? Yes, unfortunately. Alright. Leave you to it. Alright then. Yeah, let's go see Trelawney. 
God damn, I want the settings. Alright. I know that question mark is rain's fall and eagle flies, but we'll see those guys later. I know I saw Dutch go off on his horse a few minutes ago. I never seen that happen before. Yeah, you're all right, girl. What? Oh shit! The Morning Raider. Hey. Hey. Bam. Shit. Thank you, stranger. These raiders are insane. Yep. Loot them. Yeah, I do need a new satchel. I that's why I need to start hunting. I don't know what the hell's wrong with me. I keep getting distracted by shit. All right, Sherry, let's go. Yep. Uh, here we go. Okay, girl. Yeah, that's a girl. We're gonna run into anything else before we get the Saint Denis or inside it. Bonding increase level two. All right. All right, girl. Why do, why do we go in so slow when we get into town? All right. Yeah. Like I said, we're not gonna go see Mary or Brother Dorcas yet. I'm gonna go see. Take a pamphlet. No, no, no. I'm not doing that. Alright. Move, dude. Alright. I ain't parking my horse. Alright. Excuse me, ma'am. Excuse me, madam. Behind you. Good morning, sir. Alright. Trelawney. Yes, here I am. Well, we're going to need to get you smartened up a bit. What? Well, you can't play at the tables on a Lanahasi riverboat looking like this. Can't? Not yes. If you want to fit in so well, no one realizes you're there to rob the place. Now, come on. What are you talking about? That suit is not fit for the purpose at hand. Come along, dear boy. Come along. Hello. Can I help you, gentlemen? Hey. Yes, my friend here is in need of a new suit. Make this gentleman look like the duke he really is. Read. No, ain't reading. All right. You can see the aristocrat in his profile. I wish I could keep this suit. This suit looks nice. Sure. Herr Strauss has scoped the whole thing out. It's quite ingenious, actually. What is? The action he has planned. Indeed, it's not much of an action at all. You play cards and win. And you're going to bet very big and flamboyantly while you win. And everyone's going to think you're some new money from the oil fields come to lay it on thick and drunk. All the while, Herr Strauss will be signaling you in your line of sight. When you bust the place, they'll take you upstairs to pay you off. And that is when Javier comes in, and you take whatever you want. You don't think they might see an armed Mexican coming into the safe with me? Sure, they might, but perhaps not. You will see. The suspense is killing me. 
Don't Here, tell me. Jaded. We both know this is just the kind of innocent fun you thrive on. We've sure taken our sweet ass time to get to the barber. Arm robbery don't seem such an innocent pastime. No, but we, you, all of us, will be done here soon. I hope so. Come on. My good man, could you smarten up my dear hick friend hey. here? Let's do this. Fellow has made himself a fortune in the oil fields. Full stall beard. Not a lick of manners or gentlemanly deportment. Never really well, seen very good, sir. No, it's not good. Not good at all. Not if they're going to let him play big at the tables tonight. Yeah, that looks good. Yeah, yeah, it does look good. Alright. Now the hair. Style. Pomade. I only got 11. Are you serious? No, I ain't doing bald. And pomade. Bam. That's how you do it. There. Very smart. Come on. Let's get to the box. I've Come on. Some Shit. For us. Hey, Sean, how you doing? Well, I'm going through some trials. Enter. Hope you have a I look good. I really do. Grand Corrigan, sir. Well, look at you. From Toad, the Prince. Yeah, this is a bit much, ain't it, Coach? We can't when he up there on horses like a bunch of countrified yokels. Yeah, you have a point. Money to buy. Which reminds me, no shuffling and mumbling. Pop your chest out. Get outside yourself. Yeah, I'm, I don't. This ain't happening. So, who's a mark? You all right, by the way, driver? Oh, yes. Don't worry. George and I go way back. It's a man called Desmond Bly. Made a fortune in hosiery, of all things. <laughs> Likes to play fast and always keep some extra collateral in the safe upstairs. So, if Strauss is sitting behind him, how does he know what cards I got? He won't. But the dealer has recently become a very good friend of mine. Another one. Don't worry, Arthur. We're all the authors of our good fortune. We'll make sure you get the right cards. What could possibly go wrong? <clears throat> Anything. Anything could go wrong. And what money am I playing with? Don't worry. Yeah, get the hell out of the way, dude. Your chips will be waiting for you. And your sweet ass time. Ah, there she is. Come on. Okay. Arthur, even weapon me here. They are searchers when we get on. George, we'll collect these from you later. Very good, sir. Thank you, George. Good luck, sir. Now remember what I said, Arthur. Everyone is the author of his own good fortune. Yes, yes, believe me, I heard every word. Watch yep. Strauss, listen to the dealer, and this should be a very lucky night. I passed through this one so many times. I don't need Strauss's help. Gentlemen, how wonderful to see you, Arthur. You remember this pair of boys we met in New York? Come on. Champagne is on dear old Arthur. He's rich as can be and feeling luckier than a turkey that survived Thanksgiving. Hello, gentlemen. Hello, dear boy. 
Come on, come on, let's head aboard. Drink to right. Sean Arthur. Champagne. I'm afraid we require all patrons to hand over their guns. Well, I don't have my gun. The table's await. I'll go find myself a change of clothes. Okay. You seem unsure. Robbing a heavily armed riverboat without a gun turns to bring out the self doubt in me. These people are virtually idiots. This is simple stuff. Now have a good time, but don't lose too much money or your wife is going to kill me. Whatever you say. <laughs> now, where can I get a cocktail? Alright. Uh, not to say, well, this one. We have a chair here with your name on it, sir. Thank you. Play some polka. Good evening, gentlemen. Arthur Kelly. Sorry, I'm late. I had some uh, unfinished business at the bar. Evening. Desmond Fly. Evening. Not to worry. Welcome to the game, Mr. Callahan. Okay, gentlemen. Let's play. I hope you're a player. Been too many cowards at these tables recently. Nothing less dignified than a man afraid to lose a little money. Look at this. Chips are All right, Strauss is over there, but I don't need his help. I like this joint already. We aim to Go. Please, sir. So all in. How are we all fair? Some better than others. If we all fared the same in life, now damn, I have more than anyone. Quiet. Shit, everyone's Wait, going all in. Please tell me I got it. Fuck. <laughs> Goodbye, gentlemen. I guess it's just you and me now, friend. Yes, it is. Oh, we're friends Let's now. See if you're really the man you seem to think you are. Likewise, Mr. Blythe. So, what business are you in, Mr. Callahan? All right, hey, I'll be here. Where the hell's Troy? I think he's over there. You know, I thought about getting in the hosiery, but I just look better in a suit. And his hair. I would stick to oil, Mr. Callahan. I don't think you have a future on the stage. You sound just like my wife. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha! Shit. Yes, my luck hell. Is that you done? Done? Bust. Well, uh, you got something else to play with. Meaning... Well, I heard... Well, I heard there were some big boys on this boat. Maybe that's not you. No offense. Sit your hillbilly ass down. Goddamn! Why, I got a watch. Look at you. An expensive one. Real fine. Swiss. A Reutlinger, no less. It's in the safe upstairs. It's worth more than you. Okay. I just now play as you wish. Yeah, don't get pissy if I beat so you. You must know Leviticus Cornwall, big oil man like you. Something like that. We've crossed paths. I was fortunate enough to Bad tour the operation <laughs> heads up in New Hanover. And come on. <laughs> Oh, this You're motherfucker's going all in too. All in, Mr. Callahan. Don't worry, sir. Everyone is. I'm going all in too, bitch. Nothing ventured, nothing gained. Hurricane. Very good, but not good enough. You sure Shit. about that? Uh oh. Ha! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Get schooled, lines, bitch. Mr. Mr. Callahan wins with an ace high diamond flush. God damn you! Get school, no bitch. None take. Well played, sir. Unlucky, Desmond. Now, forgive my lack of discretion, but uh, where might I find this watch? It's upstairs. Shall we go and have a look? Why not? All right, this is where we get to the park. Please, cash these out for me. I, I started last week. Good. Sure. Perhaps you could escort us up to the office. Yes, of course, sir. Thank you. 
Follow me, gentlemen. Come with Go me, ahead. Sir. You're having quite the night. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. So I just whooped this guy's ass at poker two times. A a job. Should have just said twice, but too late. We live in strange times. Personally, I wouldn't trust one with a gun, but fear not. I've got my own little law giver right here. Very good. Yeah, you're dangerous. Next, we'll you're fearless, man. Yeah, I know. Oh, I know. God. You're going to like this wall, sir. I saw it earlier, and it really is a handsome piece. Foreign made, but you can't have everything. Indeed. Yeah. Well, here we are. That's the way life is. You can't have everything. Just give me one second, sir. Of course, take your time. Go ahead. All right, you ready, Javier? Dario. Don't reach for that gun. Take his gun, Arthur. Give me that gun, so motherfucker. I guess you were right. <laughs> I just bitch slapped you. Only an idiot would give a greaser a gun. Idiot, huh? Oh shit! This motherfucker got a second gun. Damn. No shit! Grab the money. Grab the money. Can I loot him? I can't loot him. Sure. That dude had a second gun. Got a few minutes to get out of here. If we look. Is that a gunshot? Oh. Come on. And how exactly are we getting out of here? I ain't too sure. This is what tends to happen when you leave Trelawney in charge of planning. Oh, garnish no meat. Probably involve us. <gasps> what the fuck, and Arthur? Are you trying to jump over the damn boat? Nice uniform, by the way. Thanks. Give anyone a job these days. Anyway, we shouldn't give ourselves away until we know we need to. Maybe we could still blend into the crowd when it all goes crazy. Which it surely will. Yep. To the bar, senor. I hope you had fun, sir. <laughs> In the time of my life. You boys sure know how to put on a show. <laughs> That's wonderful. <laughs> ah, look. There's your friend. Oh, there's Trelawney. Hey. There he is. <laughs> don't be a sore loser, friend. Something I don't like about the pair of you. <laughs> There's plenty I don't like about you, but I have the good manners to keep my mouth shut. There he is. Shoot that man. Oh, snitch. Give me that gun. Come on, Arthur. Get out of the way. Bam. Bam. Nope. Bam. <laughs> Boom. Boom. Please tell me. Got him. Holy shit. Where is it? Got him. Go on. Go, 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 go. I don't know. This ain't my show. Silly me. Motherfucker. Go. Oh, fuck. I went out the wrong way. Get out of the way, you motherfucker. Fuck. I highly doubt there'll be any alligators this far in the water, Strauss. <laughs> Shit. Well, never a dull moment. Yeah, that's one way of putting it. So, how much did we get? A few thousand, I think. Pretty good. Yes, indeed. And this watch, yeah, apparently it's worth a bunch of Swiss, a Reutlinger or something. Nice watch. 
Yes, it's a right lingo, all right. <laughs> we'll give it back then. All right, come on. Yeah, I want it. You don't get to keep it. From the bank, we're gonna be robbing soon. All right, let me check it. After your cover is blown, escape the boat under. Damn it! Oh, I shouldn't. I just had to go that wrong way. God damn it! Always do it on my own, so I gotta get through it. And the only thing I know is to love what I'm doing. Never give up, never slow till I finally prove it. Never listen to the nose, I just wanna keep moving. Keep my head up when I act. Head up, that's a fact. Never looking back, I'ma keep myself on track. Keep my head up, staying strong.